all uh, this equation and also graph it. Okay, so the question is 2 times modulus of x minus 4 plus 8 is equal to 10. So this is an equation uh, with a modulus. So you treat it as you're solving a simple linear equation. So when you're uh, solving an equation, we want to isolate the x. So yeah, the first thing that we want to eliminate or get rid of is this plus 8. So if you want to get rid of this plus 8, I'm going to take away 8 from this side. So to take away 8 from this side. So treat equation like two sides of a balance. So what happens is this and this gets cancelled. So what is 2 times modulus of x minus 4 is equal to 10 take away 8 is 2. Now you've got to get rid of this 2. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to divide this side by 2, but also divide this side by 2. So what happens, this and this gets cancelled. So modulus of x minus 4 is equal to 1. Now we have to put our thinking cap and think what can we, what does this mean? This means that whatever this number is, is 1 away from 0. Whenever you have modulus, you can think in two different ways. Or they can, you can think in different ways. Uh, one of the ways, easier way is to say, well, this is 1 away from 0. Modulus is always with respect to 0. So if you draw a number line and think about, suppose 0 is the reference point. So what is 1 away from 0? So 1 away from 0 is either 1 on the right or negative 1 to the left. So negative 1 is 1 away from 0. 1 is also 1 away from 0. So this implies I can say x minus 4 can be 1 or x minus 4 can be negative 1. So what take away 4 gives you 1? So this has to be 5. So this is, or you add 4 to both sides, you get 5. And what take away 4 gives you negative 1? So 3 take away 4 gives you negative 1. So x is negative 3. And you can check your answer by putting this back into this. So we can do it directly. 5 minus 4 is 1 and modulus of 1 is 1. And negative 3, uh, or oh, this has to be 3, sorry. So this has to be 3, sorry. So yeah, this is always good to check. So 3 take away 4 is negative 1. So 3 take away 4 is negative 1 and modulus of negative 1 is 1. You can also think this in a different way like this. Uh, x minus 4 is equal to 1. So when you say x minus 4, I can say this means the distance of x, the distance of x from 4 is 1. Now you may wonder how do you, how can you write like this? Suppose let me take a, a very simple example. Say 9 minus 4 is 5. So can I say the distance of 9 from 4 is 5? So let me draw a number line quickly. So this is your 9. This is your this is your 4 and this is your 9. So this distance is 5. Can I say the distance of 9 from 4 is 5? Same way, x minus 4 means the distance of x from 4 is 1. So whatever that x is, the distance of that x from 4 is 1. So let me draw a number line. Again, let me draw a number line. So it is from 4. So this is your 4. So the distance of x from 4 is 1. So from 4 you have to go 1 to the right. If you go to 1 to the right you will reach 5. Or you go 1 to the left. That is 3. So these are the two answers. x is 3 or x is 5.